Hey guys, it is Charlotte and welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another video. So today is Saturday and we are going to be doing our second paycheck, our last paycheck of January and we are going to be stuffing $490 into our sinking funds and also into our cash envelopes. Um, now before we get started, um, I would just like to thank you guys so much for giving me shout outs pretty much almost every single week. I appreciate all of my friends on here. Um, and to my new subscribers, my new friends on here, welcome. I am Thrifty Agent, or you can just call me Shirley. Um, I do budgeting. I um, stuff envelopes. I do challenges, money challenges. I do mini challenges on Monday, money challenges on Tuesdays. I stuff my paycheck every two weeks. Um, I do a lot of stuff, and I am so grateful for you guys to be hanging out with me. Um, so we're just going to go ahead and get started. Now, I am filming this on Friday, and we have been without internet for probably like maybe going on five hours, six hours right now because something happened down the road. Something hit like four poles, snapped the fiber. Um, so they are working right now to get our internet up. I would be very surprised if this video ends up at 9 o'clock a.m. on Saturday when you are watching this. But if not, where whenever it uploads, um, I thank you guys for watching. All right, so $490. We have 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 83, 20, 40, 60, 84, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, and 90. So $490 is how much we are going to be stuffing into our envelopes. Now, first and foremost, we are always going to be doing our cash envelopes. It is a set amount that we put every single week for gas, food, and fun money. So we have groceries and groceries is going to be getting $100. So we have 20, 40, 60, 81. And we do have some money that we're going to roll over into our money challenges, which is very exciting. So gas is going to be getting $140. So we have 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, and 40. And that is to last us for two weeks for all of these envelopes. And then next, actually, I messed this up. It's not supposed to be in vacation. It's supposed to be in fun money. So this money I take out and put into my little wristlet wallet that I bring to work every day. And I just emptied it to film this video and I accidentally put it in vacation because I already emptied the vacation and put it back into traveling. Um, so this is the fun money and we're going to set this aside and we will count this in a minute. Next one is going to be $100 for fun money. So 20, 40, 60, 81. And I really don't have anything planned for the next two weeks. I know I have to buy some birthday gifts for a one year old that I'm going to go to, um, her party, but I have no idea where I'm going to go. I'm probably going to go to TJ Maxx to be honest, because TJ Maxx is where it's at. Um, so this is the money that is left over from, from the past two weeks. So we have 20, 30, 40, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, and 64. So we have $64 that is left from our gas and from our fund money. And it's actually pretty impressive. I usually don't have this much money um, left over. I'm usually always just buying something, buying snacks, buying for gas because I'm always traveling. But this is actually a really good amount. And we are going to put this towards our either our mini challenges, which is Monday, or Monday or regular money challenges which is on Tuesday so we're gonna set that aside we're gonna have more money um, this coming up weekend so we are going to be hopefully completing some challenges which will be a very fun all right so next is going to be medical and medical is going to be getting twenty dollars <coughs> and that is right here so medical right now has 100, 200, 20, 40, 60, 70, and 75. So $275. Next is 
car maintenance is going to be getting $20 as well. So we have 150, 60, 70, 80, 90. Um, let's just set that. 120, 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 85, 86. So 186, and I can't do the math, plus 50. So we have $236 in car maintenance, which is great for us. The pets are going to be getting $30. And we are going to be buying some food this weekend for them. 20, 40, 60, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, and 75. So $75 in Dobby. Next is going to be Christmas. And Christmas is going to be getting $50, you guys. We have to... I want to actually hopefully be done with stuffing Christmas by July or August so then I can put my money towards something else. My goal is $800 for Christmas this year. Um, so I wanted to hurry up and bulk this up. And this is actually going to be unstuff on Tuesday and put towards our challenges. Um, we are currently doing a stocking challenge that will cost us $150. So this will be a great boost for that challenge as well. Um, we are not putting anything else in that. And then last but not least is going to be our home furniture. And we are still saving for a king size bed. And we are gonna be putting 10, 20, and $30 towards this. Um, let's see. So currently we have 100, 250, 60, 70, 80, 90, 300, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, and 15. So 315 dollars is how much we have for furniture right now. Um, I don't have anything for side hustle because one, I did have a return because she just didn't like it. Um, so I am waiting on that return. So that means that my my money is on hold. I think I have like roughly $30 in eBay and about, I think another $30 in Macari. So I am waiting on that and I have to wait until like February 1st. The customer has until February 1st to ship the item and if not, then I will get paid. Um, so I'm just patiently waiting. Um, we might not do a side hustle stuffing this month, but we will next month. Um, anyways, so that is it, you guys. So we stuffed our cash envelopes and we also stuffed our sinking funds. It was a great video, $490 into this. Um, cash envelopes last us for two weeks. So we're going to have to decide what we are going to do for two weeks and save as much money as possible. Um, anyways, I love you guys and thank you guys so much for all your love and support and I'll see you guys later. Bye.